if you don't have a place in your kitchen to put a microwave, so I'm going to show you this drawer microwave. That's very good. So let's say you want to put it somewhere and you don't have a place. So here under the cabinet or the, the counter top, you see this uh, cavity here. So you can, here you have the place to do that. I'm going to show you how it looks like once it is installed. As, as you can see, I just installed it. And the only downside of this is that the customer <laughs> it didn't measure the the right size of the cabinet. So here we have a big cavity. Otherwise, if you buy the right size, you know, uh, this a little bit wider will make the cabinet a little bit uh, smaller or, uh, or narrower, it will be better. So as you can see, we push button and this comes out. This is the microwave. And you put the, push the button in once again. And that's it, very easy and nice. As you can see, here we have the open and close. We click open. It will open. Put whatever you want to put here to cook, to warm up, or anything. And that's it. So it looks very nice. And that's it. The only downside is this cup that I told you it before, but it works great. So if you don't have any place where you can put it on top of the a counter is a top, or you, maybe you don't want to have it like that. This is a good option. I want to show you a few pictures so that way you see uh, that this type of microwave that drawer a microwave. I mean, it's a good option. It depends on your the type of kitchen. Some people they do this, as you can see here. They put the um, some type of shelf <laughs> and they adapt it. Another another people. You will see here they do uh, different things. So here you have another one over the over there another one. Here is more maybe the traditional. The traditional always is, you know, um, instead of having a range hood, you have the microwave with range hood all built in. That is another option. Um, I like more uh, that because usually is you don't have to kneel down, you know, to put the food and everything. But if you don't have a space. Uh, that will be a, a one option. Like I said before here, as you can see here, here is where you have the range hood and the microwave all built in. I think it's a, a, a good place to put everything here. Also, if you don't have, for instance, a ductwork, I would recommend to add a ductwork in, in this place so that way all the fumes, they go outside and this is not going to be recirculated in the, in the same room. So also I have done that uh, many times. I have a few customers where they have this issue because they cook a lot or something like that and then you know you're going to encounter those type of issues so if you have to do something like that it will be better than having it you know maybe on their counter space or something like that or something like this that is not going to look very appealing if you have to sell the house this looks like some <laughs> a little bit uh, techy uh, doing the, uh, this i mean the the other, the other thing uh, like I, I mentioned uh, before is when you have the the drawer uh, microwave it might be a little bit more difficult uh, to clean it up uh, here is i think is is easier but it is up to you so i wanted to show you this option uh, that you have if you don't have this type of um, a space in your countertop or you don't want to have it in, in the countertop it can be done and um, put it just in you know under the the counter top that you have already and it can be adapted so hopefully this video was useful if you have any question please let me know in the section below and see you next time